Welcome back. Welcome Brent. back. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Sorry, we're having technical difficulties. April 20th, the Indianapolis Chamber Orchestra is presenting the show Black Keys, and it will feature dance, singing, and music composed by black contributors in classical music that spans over three centuries. Here with a preview of the show are Layla and Linnell from Kenyatta Dance Company performing to the song Spring from Duke Ellington's The River. Friends, take it away. It's incredible. Beautiful. Great job, Layla and Linnell. Wow. Wow. That was beautiful. That was so beautiful. So graceful. Oh my goodness. You guys Great make it look all. easy, and it is not. Stuff. Yeah. That was incredible. <laughs> it was wow. so beautiful. Welcome to our friends Dana Stone and Joshua Thompson from Hi. the ICO to tell us more about this exciting show. Friends, thanks for being here. Welcome. And can you please give our dancers a shout out here? Yeah. Yeah. Yes, thank you to Kenyette Dance, to Layla and Linnell. Great. Um, there's some of our featured soloists in this special production that we have coming up next weekend. Yeah. Wow. So talented. Let's talk about how this program was developed. Yeah, Joshua, please take it away. Sure. Creative partner here. Yeah, I'm the uh, creative partner of residence with the Annapolis Chamber Orchestra, and I'm also a music sociologist and a uh, classical pianist. And I exclusively program and perform classical masterworks written by composers of African descent because we don't hear them, we don't see them. And it's just been so much fun to put together this, this collaborative project that has so much amazing talents and dance and voice and narrative right here in our own backyard in Indianapolis. It's been so much fun and uh, we're really excited for next weekend. Yeah. Really. Yeah. How long have you been planning this production? Well, it seems like a lot has gone into well it. Well over two years wow. that it's kind of been in development. So yeah. yeah, it's kind of hard to believe that it's it's finally upon us. That's so amazing. we're quite excited. Yeah. It's great. There's so much talent to be shown and I know Joshua, you kind of touched on this, but maybe let's talk about the importance of specifically highlighting some of these artists and the visibility you talked about. I, I feel like uh, sometimes for classical music it's not their back, which yeah. is fine, but there's so many stories that we're missing out on when we just focus on maybe just European traditional. Right. Uh, so any culture, so I decided to draw from my own, which is that African and African American tradition. Music is just music. It's beautiful, it's gorgeous, it's it's always telling a story and I think it's a wonderful way to disarm people and welcome them in at the same time yeah. to yeah. learn about cultures and experiences that you may not know that much about or music that you don't feel that familiar but sure. at the end of the day it's just music yeah and we're just people and we're all living this very cosmic existence on the planet so this is a program that really from my perspective tries to really illuminate that and it's been just an absolute pleasure to do it it's beautiful yeah. it can be very unifying mm -hmm. yeah. Yes. yeah Dana, if someone's never been to an indianapolis chamber orchestra concert or production what should they expect well i they should expect a very welcoming experience. Like we definitely want to share our work with as many people in our community as we possibly can. And this concert is really no exception. It's really a highlighting moment of the work that we've been doing and serving and reflecting the diverse Indianapolis community. So 
we're quite excited that this concert is sold out, Ooh, um, which doesn't great. always happen. But it, you know, when it does for classical music, we do a little dance, um, and there'll be a lot of dancing <laughs> yeah. on Saturday, April 20th. So as we kind of celebrate this multidisciplinary way that we can share yeah. classical music with, with Indy, it's going to be a lot of fun. It's awesome. Well, yeah. you can use the code Indy now, get $5 off ICO's final concert. ICOmusic.org is where you can learn more. Yeah, take the whole family. It's going to be a lot of fun. Friends, thank you so much for thank sharing you. your wonderful talents with us. That was So talented. Yeah. I mean, the lift right off the bat, that I was, was like, great. <gasps> <laughs> oh, wow. Outstanding. Friends, yes, thank, thank you for you being so here. Much. We appreciate thank it. Yeah, you best appreciate wish it. Here. Well, still to come, registered dietitian and friend of the show, Caitlin Wong, is going to teach us about the benefits of getting enough protein throughout the day. Yes, but first, here's what Ryan learned about this month's seasonal sensation, mm. as they call it at Neatler's Fresh Market. Take a look.